Good morning, all of my 26 day er reader people. I am checking in with you today in my typical messy kitchen with my weekend distractivity. It's my activity that distracts me, so it's my distractivity. It is trying to make sweet potato chips. So I will insert sweet potato chip here. Maybe. Uh, so what I'm kind of videoing for is because I want you to sign up for my weekend newsletter. It comes out Sunday mornings and this Sunday morning, September 29th, my newsletter, although I like them to be happy and funny, this one, however, is about loss and grief. So uh, sign up for it and you can weigh in on uh, how you handle loss and grief. And that is why I have this distractivity today. It is, I'm kind of working through my own personal loss because this week has been an adjustment. So my daughter is, you know, finally, I mean, really in about, you know, less than two years, she'll be on her own away at college, hopefully. And I really kind of was always wondering when she would start that typical expected pull away from me to you know assert her independence and you know it's begun and it's natural and it's normal and i honestly was like when when is this going to start uh but i'm going to be an empty nester here with my dad uh he'll be like 92 or 93 and it'll just be the two of us um shuffling around but it's been hard on me this week because my normal like partner in crime here in the kitchen um, when I'm doing this sort of stuff, um, either being annoyed with me or talking to me or whatever is gone. You know, she's um, really kind of started that process, pull away, uh, and it's normal, but I am going through kind of my own little process of grief and loss. So sign up for the newsletter and you can weigh in on what it was like for you or what you think it's going to be like for you or how you've handled your own loss, your own grief. And, you know, I hope to hear from you. Have a great weekend.